penetrate here, we're off to a block drain. That's right, we got a blocked sewer to go to. So, the lady that I was speaking to, her father, I think he lives downstairs, and um, he's been flushing the downstairs toilet, going to the toilet, flushing the toilet, and um, he noticed it was backing up a little bit and not draining properly. So he went outside and had a look and um, noticed it was coming out over the ground. So it sounds like it was coming out over the gully. She said it was an uh, older house. So I'm hoping if it's an older two-story house, there could be a stack riser point on the outside um, that might give me some good access into that drain. But we won't know until we get there and have a look. So hopefully it's a good one. Hopefully it's easy. Because I've got to get from one side of the Brisbane all the way back up to the other side of Brisbane to have a look at another block drain through peak hour traffic. So I'm hoping this one is easy. Right, oh, I'll see you when I get there. Okay, so we've got a block drain here. The grate has formed a nice little waffle top of just crap. Um, so this is the downstairs toilet. When it's getting flushed, it was coming out of here earlier today. So I'm just gonna run the jet down here. Uh, I haven't put a camera or anything down. If it's gonna be all, um, if it's gonna look like that, I'm really probably not gonna get far off the camera anyway. So we'll just jet it, then put the camera down and see what we're dealing with and see how, see how far away we are. Let's go fire it up. Spooled the um, water hose. Get up to the back corner. If you notice anything inside, just let me know. Okay. Like at any point, uh, I'll just run this down. I have a YouTube channel for block drains. Yeah. And I cool. would normally send some information when I organise a job, and it's got a link and all that stuff. Yeah. So that's what this is for. So I'm not oh, a, no, a lunatic good. talking to himself. <laughs> no, I, I really like the name Waffle Top. I got a good giggle out of that. <laughs> okay. Okay. Big penetrating nozzles on, and we're gonna whack this one down and hopefully pop it and see what's going on I can hear it gurgling. I did hear a gurgle. I think it's dropped. You can hear, hear it now. This is going down.
So I'm just mincing it up a little bit, softening all that, um, that waffle. So because all the solids were in this gully, if I don't move them down into the drain, this will stay blocked, stink. So I've got to get rid of them. You gotta always give it a bit of a clean. Just don't wanna go straight through those louvers. Get water everywhere. Let's get that camera, put that down there, and see what was causing the problem. So I've taken a couple of pictures. There was um, a couple of joints that had tree root entry. So I'm going to run the root cutter down, give them a tidy up. And then uh, we'll put the camera back down and record, record it all done. Put that back on.
we'll set this up put this back down here record it and we might be done Council main. So that looks like a reline section. Yeah. And then we're coming up here to a junction that looks doesn't look the best. Digital's made more of a difference. <laughs> it's made it a bit easier. <laughs> This one. Yeah. So we're all done here, all packed up. Let's go and wash up. So that one was nice and easy. Drains all cleared. Um, you can see on the CCTV how there looks like a section that's been relined. Um, you can see the color of it and the reline. So it looks like they relined that junction and it hasn't kind of taken up really well. Um, so what I do here is just email the CCTV to the customer and they can flick it off to the council and have a chat to them about it. Right, oh, all done here. See you on the next one.